Welcome to World Insight. Please subscribe and hit the bell icon for more breaking updates. Picture a tiny explorer, built by human hands, carrying our dreams into the unknown. In 1977, Voyager 2 launched, embarking on a journey billions of miles from Earth. It's more than a machine. It's a symbol of our curiosity and our urge to explore. Voyager 2 became our silent ambassador, venturing where no human has gone. This mission was the result of bold vision, meticulous planning, and a rare planetary alignment. NASA's team saw a fleeting chance to visit the four giant outer planets in one grand tour. Voyager 2 was our message in a bottle, cast into the cosmic ocean. The world it left behind was very different. No internet, no personal computers, and the outer planets were just distant smudges in our telescopes. Equipped with cameras, spectrometers, and a plutonium core, Voyager 2 was designed to be our eyes and ears in the deep. On August 20, 1977, a Titan rocket launched Voyager 2 into the blackness, its mission to reveal the secrets of Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, and Neptune. For nearly five decades, it has sent back discoveries that have transformed our understanding of the cosmos. Voyager 2's journey is a testament to human ingenuity and our relentless quest to know what lies beyond. It remains one of humanity's greatest adventures. Voyager 2's mission was only possible thanks to a rare planetary alignment, a cosmic shortcut that happens once every 176 years. Using gravity assist, the spacecraft could slingshot from one giant planet to the next, saving time and fuel. This made a grand tour of the outer planets possible within a single lifetime. Voyager 2's goals were simple, explore the unknown, study the atmospheres, rings and moons of the gas giants, and answer fundamental questions about our solar system. Its path was chosen so it could visit not just Jupiter and Saturn, but also Uranus and Neptune, worlds no other spacecraft would see for decades. Every bit of data it sent back was a first, revolutionizing our view of these distant planets. Voyager 2 was a marvel of engineering, built to survive radiation, cold, and the vastness of space. Its cameras and instruments became our senses, revealing wonders we'd only imagined, and it carried the golden record, a greeting to any distant intelligence that might one day find it. Voyager 2's mission was both a quest for knowledge and a message to the cosmos. It was a leap into the unknown, driven by curiosity and hope, and it changed our understanding of the solar system forever. In 1979, Voyager 2 reached Jupiter, unveiling a world of violent storms and swirling colors. The Great Red Spot was revealed as a massive, centuries-old hurricane, and Jupiter's bands as dynamic, ever-changing weather systems. The biggest surprise I.O., Jupiter's moon erupting with volcanoes, proving moons could be geologically alive. Two years later, Voyager 2 arrived at Saturn. Its rings once thought solid were shown to be countless icy particles, shaped by gravity and tiny moons. The spacecraft discovered mysterious spokes in the rings and intricate interactions with Saturn's moons. Voyager 2's close-ups of Enceladus, Tethys, Dione, and Iapetus hinted at hidden activity and unique histories. Each moon was a world of its own, full of surprises. Saturn's gravity then flung Voyager 2 onward, setting it on course for the distant ice giants. These encounters transformed our understanding of the outer solar system. Voyager 2's images and data revealed a richness and complexity we'd never imagined. The Grand Tour was already a triumph, and the journey was far from over. Next stop, Uranus. In 1986 Voyager 2 became the first and still only spacecraft to visit Uranus. Uranus, once a pale blue-green blur, was revealed as a planet tipped on its side with bizarre seasons and a strangely tilted magnetic field. Voyager 2 discovered new moons, faint rings and Miranda a moon scarred by a violent past. Three years later it reached Neptune, a world of fierce winds and deep blue storms. Neptune's great dark spot and fast-moving clouds stunned scientists. Voyager 2 found clumpy, incomplete rings and revealed Triton, Neptune's largest moon, as a frozen world with geysers erupting nitrogen into space. These discoveries challenged everything we thought we knew about the outer planets. Voyager 2's flybys of Uranus and Neptune remain unique in human history. The spacecraft's journey through the ice giants expanded our view of what's possible in the solar system. It showed us that even the most distant worlds are dynamic and full of surprises. With Neptune behind it, Voyager 2's planetary tour was complete, but its mission was far from over. It was time to look back, one last time. After Neptune, Voyager 2's cameras turned back for a final farewell. From nearly 4 billion miles away, it captured the family portrait, a mosaic of six planets, including Earth. The images were faint, 
the planets mere points of light, but their meaning was profound. Earth appeared as a tiny pale blue dot, our entire world reduced to a single pixel. This was Voyager 2's last look at home before its cameras were switched off forever. The family portrait wasn't about scientific detail, it was about perspective. It showed us our place in the vastness of space. After this, Voyager 2's mission shifted from seeing to sensing, as it ventured into the unknown. The images were transmitted across billions of miles, a final gift from our distant explorer. They remind us how small and precious our world truly is, and they mark the end of one chapter, and the beginning of another. The image of Earth as a pale blue dot became an icon, thanks in part to Carl Sagan's moving words. It's a humbling reminder, every human story, every triumph and tragedy, unfolded on that tiny speck. The photo gave us a new perspective on our place in the universe. It marked Voyager 2's transition from planetary explorer to interstellar messenger. With its cameras off, the spacecraft began measuring the edge of the sun's influence, entering a new phase of discovery. The pale blue dot image is more than a picture, it's a call for humility, unity, and stewardship of our fragile world. It reminds us that our divisions and conflicts are invisible from this distance. Voyager 2's final images are a message of perspective, delivered from the edge of the solar system. They challenge us to cherish and protect our only home. The journey continues, but the lesson endures. We are all passengers on this tiny blue world, drifting through the cosmic dark. Today, Voyager 2 sails through interstellar space, over 12 billion miles from Earth. Its faint signals take nearly a day to reach us, carrying data from a realm no other spacecraft has explored. Its power is fading, and one by one, its instruments are shutting down. Yet it endures, a testament to human ingenuity and the will to explore. Even after it falls silent, Voyager 2 will drift among the stars for eons carrying the golden record, a message from Earth to the cosmos. In 40,000 years it will pass another star, in hundreds of thousands it will wander near Sirius. Voyager 2's journey is a story of curiosity, courage and perspective. It showed us the wonders of distant worlds, and the fragility of our own. As it travels on it carries a piece of humanity into the galaxy. It is our silent ambassador, a symbol of what we can achieve when we dare to dream. The story of Voyager 2 is a story for the ages. It reminds us that, for a brief moment we reached out to the stars, and that is a legacy that will endure long after we are gone.